Okay, well, now we're on to uh, one of the new hard group fours in the market this year. And this is Champion, and quite a buzz about this variety this year. Um, it's one of the cleanest varieties that you can grow, um, and also extremely high yielding. Now, to be fair, its yield in the north is probably not quite as high as it is in um, uh, further south. Um, but it's still a highly respectable 103. Mm. Uh, it's looked really, really clean right from the start, hasn't it, guys? I mean, it's just, yep. you know, top to bottom. Um, it's um, it's very good on rust, yellow rust. It's very good on septoria. Very good on mildew, although we're seeing a small amount of mildew in, in the bottom here. Yeah, I think um, that's just seasoned rather than varietal. From yeah, the north, so. yeah. But it's, um, it's a variety that I think needs to be grown in the right place. It's a, a very, very vigorous variety again and um, definitely doesn't really want to be drilled too early, especially given its straw characters, which um, you can see again it's responding reasonably well, but it's not the stiffest straw variety. Um, and I think the other thing to keep in mind with Champion, um, Laura, is quite low on the spec weight. Yeah, I think I think that's fair to say. I mean, it's, it is... <sighs> Yeah, growers this year, hard feed wheat growers are in the very fortunate situation that there are some fantastic new varieties coming on. Um, I mean, this one, it's called Champion. It was champion of the UK treated recommended list trials. It has the out and out potential, but as Paul says, there are just a couple of things to keep in mind with it. Um, but grown in the right situation, yeah, fantastic looking huge potential variety yeah been quite popular though initial uptake on it there's, there's been a lot of it i mean to be fair probably because it's a hard wheat mm. um it's maybe been a bit further south where mm. the initial interest has come from um but you know it's uh, and again we're back to that sort of standoff between having a variety that you can drill early which will come on to a, an option in a minute but um, and one that you can't, but there's definitely a, a place for champion. I mean, with that sort of disease, inherent disease resistance, and with that sort of yield potential, um, you know, just watch the straw strength, don't drill it too quick. Mm. Um, the spec weight is definitely a little bit of an issue. I think you have to be a little bit careful where you put it. Um, for example, it is a, it's the highest yield in second wheat you can grow, but you'd wonder yeah. whether it was wise to grow it as a second wheat with, with the, the, the specific weight being as low as it is, you maybe would avoid, uh, avoid your sort of um, lighter land. It does better on heavier land, this variety, <coughs> anyway. Um, so pick your, pick your slots, I would say. Mm. Champion. <laughs> Champion.